This a very great machine, it took me couple hours to unbox and assemble. It is not loud and contains a variety of workout for any level. I would recommend it for home gym use. So for me it arrived on time and they brought it to my apartment which was awesome. The instructions were slightly hard but not too much. I put the whole thing together practically myself besides tightening the bolts or screws then my husband did that part. It took a couple of days for me to put it together given kids and working as well but also I did not have a regular screwdriver I had a drill and I did not have a wrench. Even though the instructions told me I needed this I thought I could get by without it but no you can't. The alignment of things is what also became frustrating at times and wouldn't fit so I would have to take a break and come back to it. However all of the parts were there and did fit but it just wasn't as quickly as most have mentioned. The treadmill itself is awesome I use it every other day. I'm 51 inches and 180 pounds and my son uses it as well he is 5'11 plus 165 pounds I have used it all the way to a speed of 7 and an incline of 10 but mostly speeds of 4 to 6 with inclines varying and my son have tried it at a 10 speed but not a high incline. So it endures and it is steady. It is not that loud. I thought it would fold all the way up but it can't due to the dashboard and the cup holders so I just put it up against the wall. However it does fold up and stays up. Overall awesome equipment. Firstly, this seems like a good, solid, smooth working machine. I was able to put it together by myself. Although having a helper would have been nice at a few points, in an hour or so. Love the pneumatic track lift. The annoyances started upon opening the box to find an attached sheet, picture shown, that says the treadmill is locked and will not start until you activate it if it. Com, which of course requires you subscribe to their services. They offer a free month, but of course you have to give them your credit card anyway. In my opinion, that's really bad after I spent $600 to purchase it. That's my main beef, but there are a few minor things that I think they could have and should have done. A USB power outlet to keep your cell phone charged, allowing your cell phone to output audio through the treadmill speakers via Bluetooth. It connects to it with Bluetooth anyway, why not allow O? Semicolon a separate volume control for the beeps and the audio, if connected via cable. If you have your music playing pretty loudly the beeps are just ear piercing. Please click link in description. Please like and share.